Okay, um, this is my review of the HTC Tattoo uh, review number two, and I'm um, just going to try and show uh, one or two of the features of uh, the HTC Tattoo. Uh, this is my uh, home page, you can move it through the uh, D pad here, or of course, you can swipe the screen as I'm sure you already know. Uh, let's go to one of the most common ones that we use perhaps is uh, phone book and messages. Here's my messages icon, you can just tap it and go to uh, messages here they are here. So if we wanted to, this, th there's different ways of looking at this menu, but um, uh, these are the messages that all come in. One interesting little thing here is in the bracket to show you the number of messages. You can see that one's 11. You can move up, you can move down. Um, what we do is take um, take uh, this message for example, you put, tap on that one, it will come to. Here is a message log, so this will show you all the messages. This is from me to that person, and this is from me to the same person. And you can scroll through and see all the messages that you've actually sent to and received from that person, which I think is a nice little feature. It shows you everything, the whole conversation that you've had. Tap the bottom here. Now you can choose three different keyboards. This is the one I've chosen, which I think works really, really well. And say hello. And space, you say you can, you can just about to see, um, and that you can't see at all. There you go, you can see that it types it in quite well. Um, again, you have different uh, types of keyboards. Uh, you've got your numbers at the bottom here, you tap that, it'll go to numbers, and you see six, three, three. Here you go, tap it back, it'll go back there. If you tap this one down here, keyboard disappears, and you can send the message or not. If you press the return key, We'll save that message as drafts. We'll go back to the main menu. So texting, I think, is very good. Got lots of options. Let's just go to that text message again. Uh, I think I mentioned this at the other one. You've got a menu button here which you can press, and it comes up with. Uh, you can delete, draft, compose, and settings. When you press settings, you'll go into uh, a, obviously a, a menu to select uh, how you want your text to be seen, uh, sounds. Uh, made on receiving text from the rest of it. So if you go to your people's then again you tap quick tap of that there we go you can see you can see look quite a few here um, again you've got these little pictures here that will uh, show you who's who um, and um, if you go to here at the bottom of the bottom here you have a selection of uh, people here different groups of people yes yeah, so you click this it'll come to your family friends group, click this, it'll come to a few different family friends you can see and you've got 11 in there and you come to here, it'll show you your call log Okay. so um, I think there's a, lumber, a number of good features think, on both of messages and people menu uh, the camera and the video functions um, if you go to camera you can just press that ok um, it's, you can just see a picture here We've got a zoom which you can zoom on the screen or you can actually use the d-pad at the bottom here to zoom up or you can zoom back down depending on what you want to do so, I can't see the zoom. so we'll go back and it'll icon here will switch from camera to the camera so we'll just go back to the main page uh, i have email functions set up on this um, and um, if you just press the, the oops, 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 if you press your email function, um, there you go. Right, okay. So it's coming to your email thing again. Here you can just select whatever emails you want, it'll open it out, uh, and then you can take it um, to whatever you want there. Again, if you press the menu key, it'll come up with a selection of different things where you can you can go. And do variations and change things around to suit your own hands. FM radio, which is here, uh, icon on the corner. You do need the headset in here, okay? Um, you do need the headset in here, but the radio works really, really well. You can pre tune the radio to radio stations if you want. Uh, it won't pick them up because I haven't got the, the, uh, ear, the headset in. The radio works really well, it's a nice little feature because uh, if you want to listen to things like football and all the rest of it, then you can um, you can do that it's, uh, really well. Uh, this is, a, as I said before, you can decide what you want to have on this. 
um, the features that I have you've got the music here uh, one thing that I think is a bit strange with the music is, is trying to create files um, you can plug this into your, your PC and use it as a drag and drop but actually creating new files is, is a bit strange you can I'm not quite sure whether you can or have worked it out yet but um, you can um, you can do all your files in here and again you can just decide how you want to view your music uh, and down here and there's there's lots of variations on how you may wish to to, to look and, and arrange your music files calculator there you go fantastic 56 times by 1 equals 56 yeah that's correct so you get your calculator which works really really well uh, these are line curtains, you can just see down here is the Bluetooth one. You just press that, the Bluetooth comes on and it does connect very well. And it works fine with a headset. I've got a Motorola headset, um, but it works really fine. One thing I have downloaded here from one of the applications was uh, the Google. This is at the top here. Um, you can just see a little tiny microphone sitting at the top section here. This is, um, uh, this is this is to search Google uh, with a verbal search so if you press that little microphone we'll see if it works and you can put so if you say uh, Liverpool it, uh, it's probably not quite clear enough but you can see this is a, um, an application you can download where you can actually ask Google to search for you um, let's see if it's come up with something what's it come up with I know, so to come up with something completely different, you have to be quite clear with what you what you want to say. So we'll try it again, and if we go um, Liverpool, let's see what happens. And it finds it. Um, it do it does find it successfully. Um, if it's one word, it's clear. There you go. It's come up with Liverpool and Sunderland. Liverpool two, Sunderland nil. You can just see there. So it, it's found Liverpool and it comes up with everything for it fantastic it works really well that's two two attempts and it works on the second one so you can download that in applications and there's some really good ones that you can download calendar we'll just move along here to the end Oops. you can download it that's just uh move on to the calendar yeah the calendar again you can decide what you want to do on this one then you can uh, customize it to, to, to fit in it has alarms you can put notes in it you can put every everything I think you can do on, on many calendars on any um, other mobile phones or even maybe PDA device, uh, devices so we can use the d-pad to, uh, to to go back to where we were before so we go back to the home page that's a few features uh, the text messages again from the show you before you can click through your, your emails you can, if we go to menu, you can settings, you can then again personalize all these settings um, to however you want your email accounts uh, and they're quite easy to, uh, to set up as well. So um, that's my review uh, number two of the tattoo. Um, I've had this now probably about uh, uh, five weeks.